Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. And I hope you guys noticed uh, that yes, I'm filming on a brand new camera. Um, it's actually a iPhone 12. Um, I recently upgraded to a new phone. Um, and yes, it was very expensive. But I needed to. Like, my phone was so old. <laughs> um, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoy the new qu video quality. Um, and I'm doing a haul today. So yeah, I'm going to do my part two of my spring haul. And hopefully this is the last of... <laughs> The last of spring stuff because I do not need anything else. Well, I, I just went through my inventory. And as you guys can tell, I have a lot of candles. Um, this isn't even all of it. Like, there's, it goes up. It goes up. Um, but, um, I just did an inventory to see, like, if I have room for any new stuff. And I have a limited room. So... <laughs> Plus, I need to save my money. There is something huge coming up to my channel that I've been saving money for. And I can't, I'm not going to tell you guys just yet, but it's huge. And um, get excited because there's some big things coming. Just you wait. Um, so yeah, let's get started. I have all this stuff. <laughs> Um, so this is my, the rest of the spring stuff that I got from Bath and Body Works that I want to show you guys. Um, so let's start it off with this bag here. Um, this is a, definitely a collective haul. So this stuff I purchased, I only purchase things when they're on sale. Um, so... There was a soap sale recently, a spray sale, and a candle sale. So I did buy these things here and there, and I suggest you guys do that. If you guys um, like have a list of things you want to get, don't just go in there and buy everything because it looks like things are on sale. They always have deals. But wait until they have a specific, like, today candles are on sale, today soaps are on sale, and buy it that way. You do have to go in a few times, but trust me, you will save a lot of money. So I'm going to start it off with hand soaps like I typically do. So um, they did a hand soap sale a while back, and the first one I got was good old watermelon lemonade. Um, you can never go wrong with this scent. And then um, I ended up getting three of the pistachio cream puff. So um, this one is pistachio, almond, and whipped vanilla. And this one smells so good, you guys. If you guys love pistachio, you'll love this. Um, it almost actually smells more like almond to me. Because you get a hint of that like cherry scent. It's so good. It's delicious. And so I ended up getting th three of these. Um, I don't need three. That's for sure. But they were on. I think I needed to buy four at the time. Maybe not. I can't remember. But so and they didn't have anything like that exciting. So I did get three of these. I love that scent. Um, then they had a room spray sale and you know, I got some room sprays because I feel like they're never on sale. They never have that sale and the, the room sprays are so expensive these days. So the good thing is, is they do last forever. Like they last for so long and they're really strong. Like you only need one or two sprays and you're good. Like, don't be like, spraying all over the place it'll choke you out so um the first one I got was watermelon lemonade can never go wrong sorry about the lighting it was good like five minutes ago I'm filming in front of a window and the light is going away but that's how it is <laughs> so watermelon lemonade 
can never go wrong with that scent. And I also got pink watermelon. And this one is so good. I don't know if I can smell it right now, but this one is just super sweet watermelon candy. And the packaging's so cute. So got that one. And then just good old strawberry pound cake. I'm obsessed with this scent. So got strawberry pound cake. So I'm set for spring room sprays, that's for sure. Um, and then in this next ba little baggie here, I got some pocket bags. And the only reason, I don't need any of these, but the only reason I got these was because they had this bubblegum scent. Uh, Life is Sweet Pink Bubblegum. First of all, the packaging is not cute. <laughs> I do not enjoy this packaging whatsoever. It's like, I don't know. It's kind of 80s. It's got like, I don't know. I just don't like it. But um, they rarely ever have bubblegum scents. So I actually got three of the bubblegum. Um, and then a fourth one I got, I just threw in this Somebody Loves You Tutti Fruity Candy. I don't really need this one, but it's always fun to have like Easter or Valentine's scents just, you know, to use during the holiday. So there's that one. And then I got a couple of wallflowers. They had a wallflower sale. Um, of course I got strawberry pound cake. What else is new? <laughs> um, then I got strawberry daiquiri. And this one is frozen strawberry sweet simple syrup shot of tropical rum and zesty citrus twist. So this one, I didn't think it was good enough to get in the candle. Honestly, I wasn't really a fan of the candle. It kind of smelled, um, it smelled very light, first of all, and it just smelled like your generic fruity scent. But maybe it's good in a wallflower. I don't know. Strawberry daiquiri just sounds so cute. I just wish the candle was stronger. Um, then I got pink Prosecco frosting. I did get this candle and I like it. So um, this one is pink sugared buttercream, fresh blackberries, chilled Prosecco. Super fruity, bubbly, love this one. Um, and then I got wild berry jam donut. Um, and you know, this one is sweet wild berry jam, powdered donut, brown sugar crumble. I love this scent. Um, I would, again, I wish this was stronger. So maybe in the wallflower, it'll come through. <laughs> um, but yeah, wild berry jam donut. I love the color too. It's like this purple, this like deep purple. Um, so that was it on the random stuff. Now let's move into the candles. Um, so let's see. Speaking of wild berry jam donut, I did end up picking this version up. Um, I wasn't going to get this because I, this came out last year and as you can see, I have one back here. Um, it wasn't strong like at all and I was kind of disappointed, but the packaging suckered me in this looks so good like I want to eat this it makes me want a donut like legit so I do like the scent um to me it's like a berry scent you do pick up the donut um there is a bakery scent or a bakery note in here and then I also get like kind of like a hint of like a tea like it's almost like a blackberry tea interesting so I did get wild berry jam donut. Maybe this version burns a little stronger. We'll have to see. Um, then the next one is I got a backup of sprinkled birthday cake. This one is rainbow sprinkles, whipped vanilla frosting, fluffy cake. And this one, okay, it's going to sound weird. But this one almost to me smells like a strawberry chapstick. <laughs> um, it's not like plasticky, but 
you'll just have to smell it to know what I mean. Um, and then you do get the cake note. Um, it's just like a really sweet berry scent. Um, so I love this. I like the packaging. It's super girly, light baby pink. And I don't know if I got a second one of these just to like have to like burn during my birthday, but I've always wanted like a birthday candle. I don't know, like something that says like happy birthday or something to burn during my birthday. You know, I, I buy candles because they smell good, but I also buy them just to like have like fun seasonal candles to burn during the seasons. You know, I don't know. It's just fun. So I got a second one of these. Smell it. It is different, but I don't know. I like it in a weird way. So sprinkled birthday cake. <laughs> um, then I ended up getting coconut cream pie. I did get this one online. Um, it is an online exclusive. It's toasted coconut flakes, caramel custard, and golden pie crust. The reason I got this one, I did smell it last year and I did, wasn't like too excited about it. So I didn't get it last year. But the reason I got it this year was because I could not find that toasted coconut eclair candle anywhere. Like, tell me if you guys had luck finding that one because my store never even put them out. I think only a select amount of stores got that one. So kind of weird. But I was like, you know what? I will just get this one instead. And when I got it, I actually do like it. So I don't know why... Like, I don't know if last year it had this note, but I pick up like a cream cheese frosting scent and I love it. So, and it also like you smell the toasted coconut, you smell like a little bit of caramel maybe. So I don't know. I'm actually really um, liking this one and it's the packaging is pretty cute too. So there's that one. And then, um, along in that same collection, I got a third <laughs> Positively Sweet. I did get, this is my third one. I already burned one and I have a backup and this is my third. Um, this one is Dark Chocolate Truffles, Rich Chocolate Gooey Butterscotch Candy Cherry. You guys have probably already heard me talk about this one a ton, but... Ugh, the chocolate is so rich and decadent and it's got that hint of cherry in there. It's just so delicious. I want to eat this candle. So I did get a third one and the packaging is pretty cute too. And then the last one I have to show you guys is one of the new candles from a this new collection. I'm not sure. I am never sure what the collections are called. If you guys know what the collections are called, like you are a super Bath and Body Works fan, <laughs> but I can never like, they don't list them anywhere, like what the collections are called, but I'm going to say it's like a, the watercolor collection and it's the iced lemon pound cake and it's cute. It's got like the butterflies and the yellow, super spring. This one is sugary glazed icing, pure lemon zest, and fluffy pound cake and whipped cream. And if you guys are thinking this is lemon cake pop, it is not. I, this one is way better than lemon cake pop in my opinion. Like to me, it's the pound cake, you get the pound cake and then you get like a hint of lemon. Like... It's almost like, like it's a fluffy pound cake and then you get the lemon and you get a hint of like the, the like icing glazed on top. It's super yummy. It, the only thing though is it smells like it's going to be a light throw. I don't know. We'll see. It, to me, it smells like it's going to be stronger than lemon cake pop. Lemon cake pop, I could not smell whatsoever. So I'm excited about this one and I'm glad that you can smell the cake a little bit more than the lemon. Like it's not just lemon straight up. Like you smell the cake in here. 
So I'm excited about this one. This is the only candle that I got in that collection. I just didn't think, I almost got the black cherry seltzer one. That one was good. Um, I was thinking it was gonna smell like that black cherry fruit pop from last year, if you guys remember. Um, but no, it's different. Like it's super bubbly, super zesty. And like, it almost has a hint of like lemon in there. You get the cherry, but um, it's not like the black cherry Merlot scent, like at all. Um, but that one just smelled like super light again. I don't know why their candles have been smelling like super light and watered down recently. But honestly, like I just haven't been picking up that many candles because of that. Um, you guys know I love a super strong candle and if it's not strong, then it's kind of a waste of money. So I just got the lemon cake pop. That was the only one in that collection. I didn't really care for the blue breeze one and pink lilac and vanilla. I don't like um, floral scents, so I had it passed on that one. Um, but yeah, so that was it for my spring haul. I hope you guys enjoyed and um, Get ready for summer because I have some summer videos coming up. And um, if you guys are interested in seeing more Bath and Body Works videos or just randomness, then don't forget to subscribe and give this video a like if you liked it. And I will see you guys next time. Bye, guys.